Coach, what flipped the switch between that middle of that first set because you guys seemed to be on your heels a little bit in that first set. Second set, you guys came out, never trailed after 11 to 10 when you guys went up. What happened there? Right. Uh, I think we picked it up on defense. I thought uh, everyone just stepped up their level of play. You know, I thought our subs off the bench, everyone was doing a good job and ready to go. What about Kelsey Safranek, 17 kills. She had a match high after having a match high at Bradley with 19 the other day. She was terrific, especially in the latter sets. Yeah, you know, I think Kel stepped up. Uh, she kept the ball in play even when she was off, so she, she did a good job. Uh, she's playing hard right now. After the Bradley match, you talked about how your passing and defense was much better than it was against Nebraska Omaha. How would you rate it here tonight? Uh, you know, I thought our passing was a little shaky in sets one and two, and I thought, you know, three and four, we came back and, and did some good things. Uh, I thought Maggie came in and passed well. Justine did a good job, and uh, they were focused and ready to go. Nine service errors. I'm, not, I'm sure you're not entirely happy about that, but you got to be happy about the eight aces that your staff came up with. Yeah, you know what? I think we're, we're working on serving aggressive, and, uh, you know, we've got to kind of keep the ball in play, though, when we're struggling. Ann Miller came in as their leading attacker and leading point scorer. You guys held her in check terrifically today. How did you do that? Uh, you know, I think, uh, you know, we served her aggressive. She's a great player. Uh, I thought we did some slowing down on the blocks, and... Uh, Touched a few more balls, and we just played uh, better defense, I thought. And you got to love the resiliency. Every time from when you guys took the lead, 11 to 10 in that second set, every single time that they tied it, you guys took the lead back. They did not overtake the lead one time. you got to love the resiliency there. Right. You know, we just talk about siding out faster and coming back and not letting teams get strings of points on us. Last thing, Coach, big weekend this weekend here at the Chicagoland Challenge. You guys have DePaul on Friday, Montana State on Saturday, which isn't part of the tournament, and Saturday night, whether it's in the championship game or consolation game at 7 and 5 o'clock. Good chance for fans to come out here and see the Flames yeah, play. We're, we're super pumped to be home this weekend, and, and it's exciting to play all these Chicago teams and Montana State. Uh, we're just getting ready for conference. Thanks, Coach. Appreciate the time. Good luck the rest of the season. Great start to the year 3-0. Yeah, thank you. That's Coach Katie Schumacher-Colley. Flames approved to 3-0 with a win tonight against Western Illinois. Three sets to one.